Oh, load times. Just a few seconds too long. I'm just walking around with some arrows. Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Yep, Malborn's all set. Good. I have your invitation to the party. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here, put this on. When you're the ready, deceiver's finery? keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Malborn smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like... Okay, okay. I should have got the Deceiver's Finery, though. I think that would have been better. That. Oh, yeah, this is real... Yeah, I look like I'm attending a party. Uh, I can't get rid of my bow and arrows for some reason. Alright, I'm ready. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? You see this dialogue option? Do you see this dialogue option? I didn't even have to put my stuff in the house. Lydia! Why didn't you tell me? <sighs> Let's do this. Don't worry. It will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. All right. Well, I guess Lydia's staying behind. Of all the times I choose to bring Lydia somewhere, she has to be left behind. How ironic is that? That that kind of sucks. I'm a werewolf! Who ate all the chips? Okay. Ah, a fellow latecomer to Ellenwyn's little soiree. And arriving by carriage, no less. I salute you, sir. My lateness is due more to getting lost on the way up this god's forsaken mountain than to any desire to actually arrive late. I prefer to arrive early, often the day before the party, so as not to miss out on any of the drinking. Nice. Welcome to the Thalmor Embassy. Your invitation, please. Here you go. Thank you, sir. Go right in. Now, All right. Here's my invitation. I don't have a poison dagger strapped to my thigh, etc., etc. I'm just doing my duty, sir. <laughs> Everything's in order. Welcome back, sir. All right, the Thalmor Embassy. Let's party on down. Are we going to have to kill some high elves? Wait. They all they they are called Thalmor, aren't they? In the Altmer. I don't I'm so confused. No, 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 no. Bosmer. I, I, frick, I'm so confused. Look at that armor. Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Ellenwyn, the Thalmor ambassador to Skyrim. And you are? Um. My name is Draconis Deathscale. Pleased to meet you. Ah, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. Please, Madam tell me more about yourself. So what brings you to this... <laughs> to Skyrim? What is it, Malborn? It's just that we've run out of the Alto wine. Do I have your permission to uncork the... Of Arindia course. Red? I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Yes, Madam Ambassador. My apologies. We'll have to get better acquainted later. Please, enjoy yourself. Oh, I will once I steal that armor from you. Dang, you guys are strapped. Oh, this party sucks. What can I get for you? You made it in. Good. As soon as you... Yes, what do you need? Oh, God. Ruined the dialogue option. I'm ready. Of course. Let me see if we have another bottle of that. I'll be waiting by the door for everyone to be distracted. All right. The Great War is long past, 
It's time the Empire and the Aldmeri Dominion put aside their differences. Prosperity is good for everyone. I don't recall seeing you at one of these before, and I know everyone who's anyone in Skyrim. Good for you. You are magical. You can play the flute without playing it. I hope you're enjoying the music, sir. I'm enjoying the music. I hope you're enjoying yourself, sir. I'm enjoying myself. There are words spoken and words unspoken. Beware these about more. All right. They want a distraction. They are adept in both languages. The Great War is long I can't past. shout. It's time the Empire and the Aldmeri Dominion put aside their differences. Prosperity is good for everyone. What brings you to this party? You must be new to Skyrim, or you'd already know who I am. I have a stake in most anything of importance in solitude. I feel that it's time to put aside the grievances of the past and let peace and prosperity flourish between the Empire and the Aldmeri Dominion. I try to do my little part. Besides, just between you and me, it's making me pots of money. <laughs> I want to stab you in the face. You sound like quite the businessman. But not every Nord is obsessed with strength, honor, and skill at arms. A rare few are born with a gift for making money. My investments are my strength, and my wealth is my weapon. As for honor, well, there are some luxuries even I can't afford. Huh. Your wealth wouldn't help you. Or would I strike you down? Very well, then. There's a likely-looking filly, even if she is an elf. <laughs> what the crap? Serving girl! What's your name, dear? Ah, oh, Raylus, sir. Do you need a drink? Something to eat? No, no, that's not what I'm interested in right now. I just wanted to get a better look at you. I like what I see, my dear. And believe me, I don't say that to everyone. I'm very discriminating when it comes to the female form. Ah, uh, thank you, sir. Was there anything else I could do for you? Oh, Watch not at it. the moment. Maybe later. Don't go far. Yes, sir. Sexual themes. Quick! They're distracted! Go! Oh. Hey, you. Dang, you're tall. What do I do? <laughs> What do you need? I'd like a drink. Here you go, sir. The finest Colovian brandy. Is there anything else I can get for you? I'm ready. Of course. Let me see if we have another bottle of that. I'll be waiting by the door for everyone to be distracted. I don't understand. At least Ulfric's men are willing to fight for their principles, barbaric as they may be. Do I beat the crap out of somebody? What can I get for you? I'd like a drink. I'm sorry, but I think you've had enough for the moment. You douche. Until next time. The hospital. Let me take a swig. It's a quest item. What? What? Okay, let's check the quest log. <sighs> How do I make a distraction? I have this plate. It's levitating. Check it out. Alright. The degeneracy of the Empire is on display here in this room. Wow. 
What are your duties here in Skyrim? I lead the Justitiars. We are charged with enforcing the ban on Talos worship. Nords can be quite stubborn. They're slow to change their ways, and we find more heretics every day. But mark me well. I will purge the heresy from this land as surely as the flame burns the flesh from the bone. Ah, uh, you should let people do what they want. Can there truly be peace between the Empire, between the Thalmor and the Empire? There is peace now, and that peace will continue for as long as it suits our needs. But make no mistake, this is not a peace forged out of necessity between rival nations of equal strength. It is more like the calm between storms, and the next storm, I think, will be far deadlier than the last. Okay. Until next time. I'm sorry, sir. I'm on duty. God, what do I do? Hey, watch it! The hospitality of the Thalmor Embassy is at your service. What's the hurry? I tried knocking your glasses out of your hand. Apparently that didn't work. Hey, guys, look at me! I'd say this is that, pretty distracting. The degeneracy of the Empire is on display. What the frick? I'm so glad you could attend today. I hope you're enjoying the music, sir. Oh man, what do I do? Please, help yourself to more wine. I can see you spared no expense. <laughs> of course not. One does not gather the most important men and women of Skyrim and then serve them cheap ale and stale bread. This is only a taste of the benefits that accrue to those that align themselves with Thalmor interests. Great. Do enjoy yourself. What does a fellow need to do to get a drink around here? Ah, oh, pardon me, friend. I didn't see you standing there. Allow me to introduce myself. Rosalon. Imports and exports by trade. Observer of human nature by avocation. Here, I brought you a drink. Ah, the one generous soul amongst a gathering of pinch pennies and lick spittles. If there's anything I can ever do for you, do not hesitate to call upon me. Yes. Actually, there is something you could do for me. Wonderful. I can begin to repay your generosity immediately. Say on, friend. I like how he had trouble saying generosity. He was like, generosity. I need you to cause a scene. Get on the dance floor and shake it. Now uh, get everyone's attention for a few minutes. Is that all? <laughs> My friend, you've come to the right person. You could say that causing a scene is somewhat of a specialty of mine. Stand back and behold my handiwork. Oh God. Attention everyone. Could I have your attention please? I have an announcement to make. Let's go, let's go. Before anyone notices us. All right, let's go, let's go. Let me do the talking. Nothing could be more unlikely Let's go. than that someone would actually want her in their bed. Oh, okay, what are we... Most of you are already in bed with So far, so good. Let's hope nobody saw us slip out. Nah, we need we're to pass okay. through the kitchen. Your gear is hidden in the larder. Just stay close and let me do any talking, got it? Follow me. I'm ready. 